Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm so excited to be back on my main channel. It has been so long since I've uploaded, but I have so many video ideas planned for this summer. If you guys don't follow my vlog channel, I briefly explained how I'm going to be doing my main channel and my vlog channel this summer. On my vlog channel, I'm going to be uploading every Monday and Thursday, and on my main channel, I'm going to be uploading every Wednesday. So I'm really excited for you guys to see this video because I'm doing 2017 summer trends. There's been so many things that I've seen on Instagram and Pinterest, and honestly, anyone can pull these trends off. You guys should definitely subscribe to me because you're already here, so why not? So there will be a link in the description box down below that'll take you to my channel and you can hit subscribe. And then next to subscribe, there's a little bell. And I would really like if you guys click that too because it gives you a notification every time I upload, which will be every Wednesday. I promise. I hope I promise. I hope, I don't know if it's gonna follow through, but we're gonna see. So without further ado, let's get into the video. So the first summer trend I wanted to share with you guys are fishnet tights and fishnet socks. They have been so in recently, I've seen so many pictures on Instagram, and I actually wore fishnets for the Chainsmokers concert. I feel like it can like really express your style if you're like into like the edgy look. The second summer trend that I have is wearing off the shoulder tops. They have been really in recently. I just feel like they're really cute for the summertime, so if you don't have an off-the-shoulder top, definitely buy one because they're definitely in. Another summer trend that I've seen so much recently on like Instagram and Twitter are space buns. That's why I decided to wear them for this video. thought it was kind of like appropriate, you know what I mean? They're so easy to do. Like this took me probably five minutes or less to do and it looks super cute. The first time that I did them, I was like, I'm not gonna like this on me. Like I've seen people do it and they call them like, I don't know, you look like an alien or something like that. And I was like, that's definitely not gonna look cute on my hair, but I tried it because I really wanted to wear them like that for the Chainsmokers concert. And I really liked how it looked. So decided to wear them for this video because I thought it would be a good idea because it kind of fit the theme. Another trend that I've seen are overalls and I actually just bought a pair of denim overalls that is like a skirt and I wore it I think last weekend and I love it. I think it's so cute. A lot of people like to take like the one strap off and let it hang. That's really cute. It's really fashionable right now. I like pairing this outfit with my white Adidas or Converse or anything like that. It just makes it kind of look like it's like casual but cute at the same time but you don't have to put a lot of effort into it because it's one piece clothing. You just gotta wear a shirt underneath. I mean, you don't have to, but it'd probably be a good idea. One piece bathing suits have been super in for the summer and I still have yet to buy one. I really wanna get one that says Baywatch. I just think it'd be really cute to take a picture wearing that bathing suit on a lifeguard chair at the beach. I don't know, I have visions in my head. I always like plan out pictures before I take them. Also, what's great about one-piece bathing suits is that they are flattering for any type of body type. So I have seen like Kendall Jenner and Selena Gomez wearing denim on denim a lot and I wanted to try it one day so I actually tried it and I didn't think it was going to look right on me but I actually really liked how it looked and if I can wear it and pull it off, you guys can wear it and pull it off, I promise you. So whenever I've been online shopping, I've noticed a lot of two-piece clothing sets and they are so trendy this summer and I actually bought one recently at Hollister a couple weeks ago. This outfit will be in my summer vacation haul in a couple weeks. These two-piece clothing items are really trendy and I can't wait to wear this outfit at the beach. It's going to be so cute. It's like flowy and it just feels very comfortable. Tumblr pool floaties have honestly been super popular lately and I have recently just bought a huge flamingo floaty a couple weekends ago because I wanted to take it to our family friend's house. They have a pool so I wanted to take it there and like take cute pictures on it. I actually vlogged my Memorial Day weekend so if you want to see that I will have a link for it down below but it shows us like blowing up the flamingo floaty and how big it was and like us taking pictures on it and it was just so much fun and the pictures turned out really cute. So they have been super in this summer and there's like unicorns, there's like a pegasus, there's popsicle floaties, I've seen like pretzel floaties and like there's literally any kind of like emoji in floaty form. The flamingo floaty that I bought was only $30 at Walmart so and Walmart actually had a lot of different ones that you could choose from 
So I definitely recommend you getting a pool floaty, even if you don't have a pool. I don't even have a pool and I bought the floaty. I just bought a pair of uneven cut jeans at, I think it was H&M like a month or two ago and I wear them almost every day. I love them. The uneven trim at the bottom of the jeans are really in right now. I've seen so many celebrities wearing them and it just like, I don't know, it kind of gives like a little bit of like style to an outfit but it's super trendy and you can honestly find these kind of jeans anywhere now because the distressed look is really in so anything that's like torn everyone likes like i've noticed that there have there has been t-shirts at forever 21 that has holes in them that you could diy yourself but that's like in the last trend that i wanted to share with you guys is putting glitter in the middle of your hair but i think it's super cute for like concerts and stuff i actually whenever i went to the chain smokers concert and i had space buns in i put glitter in the scalp of my hair sorry lauren i know you don't like the word scalp but it actually looked really cute and I really liked it and then if you hairspray it, it stays in longer. I definitely recommend if you are going to a music festival or a concert this summer that you should try that because it's really cute, it's super in obviously and I've seen it all over Instagram and Twitter and Tumblr and Pinterest, like honestly any social media website out there there has been stuff about putting glitter in the scalp of your hair everywhere but those are all of the trends that i have for you guys i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did give it a big thumbs up kind of like kicks off the summer in a way and i will see you guys in my next video bye guys